Invest 90L, here are the latest numbers. It's moving to the northeast at 7 miles per hour. Pressure has actually come down a little bit to 1,010 millibars, but you can see it's still sitting, well, the center where they think it is is down here, but it's just a real broad area of low pressure, and all of this is going to track off towards the north and the northeast. So it's kind of a nothing burger, somebody on my Facebook stream said tonight. Uh, at this point, it is. But the Hurricane Center says about an 80% chance that as it moves to the north and northeast, that it develops as we get into, especially tomorrow afternoon, tomorrow evening, and into Sunday. Obviously, we're running the models on it, so here we go. Spaghetti models, May 15th. Uh, I stopped it right here because I wanted to show you this little curve that kind of goes by the Carolinas. I've been telling my friends up there just to keep an eye on it. Some models were taking it into Carolina. Most models are keeping it just offshore. I think it stays just offshore, but could skirt it just a little bit closer. Here's the big look at the model, and you can see that most of the moisture, look at all this rain over here. It's all going to stay offshore, the heaviest rain at least. There will be some showers like there are now over on the east coast of Florida, and even some for the Carolinas. But it's this front that's coming to pick this up and push it out to sea, and that timing's got to be just right to keep it further offshore. Right now, it looks like it's going to happen, so good news there. Now, for us, this is for tomorrow. I cut rain chance back a little bit to only about 30% for tomorrow afternoon. This is the morning. Watch right here in the afternoon. A couple showers will blow back towards the coast, and that is just about it. Notice the system is moving slowly north-northeast throughout the day. This is actually Sunday morning and now into Sunday afternoon, and things will be pulling away for us. So we're looking pretty good as far as our weekend forecast goes. In fact, it's going to be warm. That's really the only issue. 30% rain chance for tomorrow, 10% on Sunday, but it's up near 90 degrees. 87 is average for this time of year. Our next front, guys, gets in here Tuesday. Small chance for rain with it, but look at these nice temperatures on the backside. How about some low to mid 80s Wednesday and Thursday of next week?